News Nation's Kelsey Kernstein is live for us in Louisville, Kentucky. So, Kelsey, what else happened at this hearing? Yeah, you know, Nicole, this was a very short hearing that lasted about five or ten minutes. We just got out of the room, but we can tell you that all charges are dropped against Scotty Scheffler. Uh, we do know that Jefferson County prosecutor, that he spoke in this hearing at the very beginning, and he started with the tragedy of the deadly accident as Scotty was trying to get to the tournament, the PGA tournament that day. And he started with that tragedy, and then he went through the rest of the events that happened that day. But he said, this is interesting, he said, quote, Scotty's saying what happened was a misunderstanding was corroborated by the evidence. For these reasons, all charges have been dismissed against Scotty Scheffler. Now, Scheffler's attorney also agreed, and that was that. And again, it lasted just about 10 minutes. Uh, but I do want to show you this. We got our hands on some new video here. This is pretty interesting. It appears to be from the Scotty Scheffler arrest on May 17th. This is an audio video. We have reached out to Louisville police to authenticate the video, and we have not heard back. But you got to take a listen. Watch this. As he was reaching in the car, he, he grabbed my shoulder and hit me. Like, like trying to get you to stop, right? Yes. Okay. It, it seemed to be a little bit over aggressive because the entrance was open. I pulled a little bit because I was afraid. I thought he was going to start hitting me, and I didn't know who he was. He didn't tell me he was a police officer. I didn't. All I saw was the yellow jacket. I didn't know what he was doing. So the thing is, he's he's wearing a uniform. He also is wearing the same jacket that I have on that says police. Yes. Okay. Also. On that, if someone's telling you to stop, no matter who it is, you don't keep going. So what happened is you kept going and you took him with you yes. while he's a pedestrian, okay? Which is not a good thing, right? Very... Listen to me. So make it even worse. When he asked you to get out of the car, you refused to get out of the car. I still did not, was not aware he was a police officer. I was actually looking out the window of the car to try to find a police officer. I, I, I asked. We're, we're all right here. We're all wearing yellow vests so you can if see he, us. If he knew he was a police officer, I would have been much more or less afraid, but panic kind of set in. As you can see, I'm still shaking. Again, that video appears to be from that arrest of Scotty, that it happened on May 17th. Again, we have not authenticated this video. We reached out to Louisville Police Department, waiting to hear back. But just the next, uh, let's look at the time, the next 13 minutes or so, we are going to hear from a news conference from Scotty Scheffler's attorney and get the latest updates on what happened in this hearing today. We'll be here live on the ground watching this. Nicole? Absolutely, yeah. We plan to take that uh, press conference live. Kelsey Kernstein, live for us there in Louisville. Thank you.